Hey guys, it's gonna be the saddest part of the vlog. I'm gonna go, um, riding on the dog, I'm riding on the dog. Riding on the dog, I'm riding on the dog. This is why. I'm riding on the dog, I'm riding on the dog. Because I'm happy. I'd say thank you to the Skate family for letting us stay. Thank you, Eric, Heather, Houston. These are awesome. house. She's currently being just discharged from the hospital. I guess she was sick, so hopefully she feels okay. But, yeah. Something's like road markings. What are these arrows? So just for context, this is mine and Eric's second time in San Francisco. Technically it's my third. Technically it's his third. Technically it's my, it is my second. And this is Matt's technically first time. Yeah, so technically second, reality first. Because you went Yeah, because I drove through here. The... Like we went down to Lombard Street. All I remember was just like, why are we in traffic? But yeah, we're going down the widest road in the world. Oh, you went down that? Yeah. We didn't is, get to go down that. Dumb, but, but it's just we're, we're trying to go see it. It's just like, road. I get it. Like, and then Devin's never been here. First time. First time. So you're the real first timer. Yep. Matt's seen it, ish, sorta. But yeah, we're almost at Mel's house. We're like turning, yeah, we're like turning. She's on 42nd and we're going on 41st. So the first time me and Eric came here, we were like astonished that like this, this like everything, like up, all the cables are above ground. And we figured it was just like telephone lines and stuff, but it's literally all of their cable, all of their electricity, or at least almost all of it, is above all of ground. Their cable work. Literally just because of the earthquakes. Because you put it underground and it breaks, you have to like rip up the whole asphalt to go down there and get it. And you think about how long it takes it, to install. And they have earthquakes like all the time. Now so. after the cable thing falls, it's got to pick up the cable. Yeah, like look at how look. It's like Spiderman. Like what? Spiderman. Spiderman's, Spiderman's been flying like, through here. Practicing it. Freaking autofocus, Matt. <laughs> Dad, blame you. Look at all those cables. Hundreds and hundreds of cables. <laughs> We're going to the beach, well, cliffside. Give me your top five Eric advice tips for San Francisco. A non San Francisco, a non San Franciscan, yeah. but it's been here. He's learned enough about the city. I really don't like. Know, I don't know that. I I just know enough to just get say by. like number one something that you would tell anybody that's going to San Francisco the first time. Uh, first thing you tell first someone. Thing, always be alert always be ready always be alert city, always be ready it's got a large um a large tourist population but the locals really are like locals like they really don't want to put up with any of your touristy all right um what's the second thing you tell someone um just stay out of people's way stay out of every stay out of everyone's way because people have daily daily lives here it's a big like, city of industry and business so you really just want to stay out of people's way like do you People are really nice, but you stay out of their way. All right. Third. Uh, 
<laughs> Third thing. What would you say? Give me like a second. Okay, what's your Pu public transportation is king. King. So no queen. It's the king. it's the best best most efficient way to get around the city. The public transportation here is awesome. You can get anywhere you want, super super fast, but like they like they give no fucks. Like you get out of way of the buses and the trains, like they move fast, they try to be as close to on schedule as possible. And um like they'll they'll just leave without you wherever you're at. They'll just completely leave without you. Alright. That was number three, right? Yeah. Do you have number four? Yeah, give me a quick pause. Okay, quick pause. Number four. four. There are no bathrooms anywhere in the city. So if you're in a very high touristy area, then that's fine. You know, there's normal a lot of restaurants, a lot of places to eat, drink, use the bathroom. Oh, come on, we gotta go. You gotta be quick, gotta be quick. Gotta be... There are five, you gotta yeah. be quick. He's such a good dog, he's chilling with them. He like, won't leave like the 20 yards. Oh, get him, get him, get him. Yeah! <laughs> It's so cold. It's so cold. He's like, out of here. No, no, no. Bad idea. Oh, God. Mom. Mom, what do I do? Mom, so dumb. Can you see where he ripped it at so, like, we can use this to, like, six? Yeah, we can use this six. This is the first bus ride I've ever taken, and Devin. It's basically. Whatever ride we're on, it's the first time. Um. Five oh, tips for people coming to San Francisco for the first time. First time. Tur number one. Number one. Um, keep your eyes up. Keep your eyes up. That's number one, guys. Number two. Uh, stay vigilant. Stay vigilant, guys. Keep your eyes open. <laughs> Three. Um, uh, eyes up. Stay vigilant. Have fun. Have fun. That's three. I should be number five, but number four. Get lost. Get lost. Number five. Find your way home. <laughs> Find your way home. I like that. Dylan, I applaud you. Thank you. Now let's look at this super cool skyline. I didn't get to see this last time. I think I already said it. You have to continue with slide. You can't stop until the door. Now we're probably going to go to Union Square. Yeah, so. How about this one? Is it if I do it? What? This is our friend Mel. Say hi, Mel. Hi, Mel. You're on the vlog. Hi, on the vlog. I told you.